Qualification of flow cytometers ensures that the output generated on the instruments is reproducible and precise. For IVD instruments, BD performs various qualifications. On installation, environmental and utility requirements are verified against manufacturer specifications. A BD field service engineer performs IQ for BD's fax lyric flow cytometer and provides a lab report containing key specifications. During the OQ phase, instrument function is verified against manufacturer specifications and user requirements. A BD field service engineer will perform an operational qualification to measure readiness. Cytometer performance is assessed through various measurement parameters. Detector linearity can be assessed using multi-intensity hard dyed beads by plotting the fluorescence intensities associated with different bead populations versus the ERF or MESF values. BD Fax Lyric uses a ratio metric method to calculate detector linearity for each fluorescence detector using BD CSNT beads, which is the ratio of different CSNT beads across the detector range. Electronic noise is inherent background noise that impacts the overall detector resolution. It is presented as robust standard deviation. Relative fluorescence detection efficiency is represented as QR. The relative optical background signal is represented as BR. Resolution is dependent on QR, BR, and electronic noise, each predicting a cytometer's ability to resolve dim population. Resolution sensitivity, as measured by BD Fax Lyric, is the ratio of the MFI of the bright bead to twice the standard deviation of noise of a given detector. This is related to another metric of resolution, the stain index. Stain index provides an instrument-specific measure of relative detector resolution. The stain index values were measured using the CD4 stain cells and the listed fluorochromes on BD Fax Lyric. Carryover can be assessed by acquiring triplicate of sample containing high concentration of target cells, followed by triplicates of sample containing low concentration of target cells, with high and low concentrations chosen relevant to each assay. Carryover was determined for a CD45 population using CD45 per CP. The primary objective of cross-instrument standardization should be to issue the same patient diagnosis or to produce the same experimental result, regardless of where, when, or who analyzed the samples. The complexity of multi-instrument standardization varies depending on the number of labs, instrument platforms, and intended use. Use of CSNT beads to automatically adjust PMTV gains to meet target MFI values allows cross-instrument and cross-site standardization on BD Fax Lyric. Compensation in flow cytometry mathematically eliminates fluorescence spillover of one fluorophore into secondary detectors. Several types of compensation controls are available, each with pros and cons. BDFC beads are used to set up compensation on BD Fax Lyric. Spillover values are automatically updated as part of daily QC without rerunning single color compensation controls. 